This is Coyote News. Over the weekend, the women's soccer team hosted two opponents at the First Bank and Trust Complex. The Yotes welcomed Summit League newcomer St. Thomas on Friday, but the welcome didn't last long as USD's Tiana Moore recorded a goal in the opening 10 minutes of play. Moore earned her first ever collegiate hat trick with a pair of goals in the 34th and 55th minute of play. The Coyotes finished strong as Alexis Mitchell found the back of the net during a penalty kick, leading the Yotes to a 4-0 victory. On Saturday, Western Illinois decided to strike first going into the half with a 2-0 lead. The Yotes battled back in the 76th minute with an Alexis Mitchell goal, but the Leathernecks defense helped them claim their first conference win of the year. The Coyotes hope to bounce back in Oklahoma against Oral Roberts on Friday. The USD cross-country team ran at the Briar Cliff Invitational on Friday. The men's team finished on top of the eight-team field with four runners finishing inside the top 10. All Coyote scoring runners crossed the line inside the top 15. Murga Gameda and Charlie Babcock had a 1-2 finish for USD, with Sioux City native Gameda gaining his first ever co collegiate win at his home course. The women's team also finished the day on top with the five scoring runners finishing inside the top 10. Ella Byers took home the win with Abrielle Jurley rounding out the podium in third. After the weekend sweep, the cross country teams are taking the week off to prepare for the Bradley Pink Classic on October 15th.